Yeah, my DJ friend. Uh, he's he was surprised one night when I uploaded three mix, three mixes at once, three mixes in one night. And he's like, dude, you gotta space it out. You gotta promote yourself. You gotta have them anticipate and wait for the next thing you bring out to the world. And he has a point. And I thought about that too. But then I came to realize that he and I were in different positions because he's trying to establish himself as an artist, trying to gain a following, trying to gain listens and likes and whatnot. Me, I I'm just like, I wouldn't mind just putting it out there. So whoever comes across it can listen to it. If not, they're missing out, which is fine with me because I made it, I'm proud of it. It represents me. Honestly, there are lots of mixes and lots of vids that no one watched or listened. And I mean, it doesn't rub me the wrong way. I accept it for what it is because, hey, I made it, you know? And sometimes I do go back and listen to it. Most of the time in my car, I'm listening to Nantaro mixes. So whoever rides with me, they're listening to Namtaro mixes, you know? They get to enjoy it. Right. As of this moment, there have only been 49 uploaded mixes. I have made 60. So there's 11 mixes I haven't uploaded yet. But I was also debating, hmm, should I upload all of them at once? Or like space it out like every week, upload one. I mean, I date the mixes, so I don't... So it doesn't matter when I upload them or not. But if I put them all up at once, I guess whoever's into it can listen to it. And as usual, he says, oh, find your sound, like, find a sound that you're, you identify with. <laughs> kind of funny, because recently I made a mix that was heavily dubstep based, and then another mix was heavily Euro, pop, Euro dance based, so it's like fast paced songs, not like the 128 BPM songs. And one song had like, half of it was hard style. I usually end with a hard style song, but this makes like half of it was hard style, like snares pounding at you at 140, 150 BPM. Yeah, so regarding mix, like I'm zero over zero. I'm undefined, you know? But it's fine with me. Like all the DJs out there, I know they don't only listen to the genre they make. They had to diver they diversify. Like Oliver Heldens, he listens to 80s, like funky songs, you know? He even made a mix about it. Like with Diana Ross, I'm coming out and whatnot. Because to establish your sound, you have to have a broad musical knowledge. 